Hello, today I'm going to show you how to create this text effect. First open a new document, press the letter T for the text tool or select it from the toolbar panel and type your text. Let's resize it and choose a different font. Now holding down the control key, click away from the text to deselect and then press the letter V to switch to the selection tool. In order to move the individual characters, we will have to convert this text into shapes. To do that, go to Object, select Expand, make sure Object and Fill are checked and click OK. Next, either go to Object and select Ungroup or right-click with your mouse and choose Ungroup. Now select individual shapes, resize them and place them in a way so they overlap each other. Try to be creative. When you are done, select everything and then press the Ctrl and G buttons on your keyboard to group everything together. Now open the Align window. If you don't see it, go to Window and select Align. Make sure Align to Artboard is checked and choose Horizontal and Vertical Align Center. Now right-click with your mouse and choose Ungroup. Next, we will duplicate these shapes and place them on a different layer. To do that, select the new layer icon from the bottom, then click on the blue square next to layer 1, hold and drag to the above layer. While you are dragging your mouse, press down the Alt key as well. Next, click on the small circle next to layer 1 to select it and then press the Ctrl and A keys on your keyboard to select everything. Let's change the fill to white. Then select the above layer and change the fill to light red. Now go to Pathfinder panel. If you don't see it, go to Window and select Pathfinder and choose Exclude. You can notice the white color text under the excluded areas. Let's change the background. First create a new layer, then switch to the rectangle tool and draw a rectangle to cover the whole artboard. Now drag this layer to the bottom and change the fill to a darker shade of red. Finally, we will add some style to it. Select the layer 2 Go to Effect, Stylize and choose Drop Shadow. Click OK. You could leave it as it is or you can turn off the visibility of layer 1 to get a different effect. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.